Not the only district who went back to school today. Edgefield County students also back in the classroom. and They've been going year round for a couple of years now, so they're old pros. Our Maria Sellers talked to them to see how it's going so far. Busy hallways and early morning buses mean one thing. School is back in session for students at Strom Thurmond High School. I am ready. I am here. I'm energized. I'm happy to be back. Their smiles, hugs, and plenty of photo opportunities as students reunite with friends they haven't seen in weeks. And it's been a while. Not as long as we think it has, but it's still been a while. Never, um, never mind the circumstances, we're here and we're ready. It was a shorter summer than usual. But we didn't start until August 1st last year, so that was our first year, so we, we backed it up just a little bit in the summer. Um, so really, this is probably the shortest summer we'll have. The district enters their second year of having a modified calendar with two week breaks every nine weeks. I think that folks maybe stressed a little bit the first nine week, but once that first two week uh, period hit us, then folks were relieved and, and seemed excited to have it. He says the first year went well based on preliminary data from the state and students say they enjoyed it too. Um, it worked out pretty well, better than we thought because you know with the schedule now if it's modified, we think the two weeks will be something we'll be interested in. And as the new school year gets going, Chen says he has a lot to look forward to. Having a good time, receiving a good education, and hopefully being a role model inspiring that. And they're hopeful this is just the start of a great year. In Edgefield County, Maria Sellers on your side. And it starts with a great attitude, and it looks like he definitely has that. But O'Gorman says as they get back into the school year, he reminds parents how important it is for students to start a routine, get a good night's sleep, so you can stay awake in class.